Link tracking tells you when an email recipient clicks on a link in your message. In this lesson, we'll learn how to track links in your emails and where to find your link tracking data. Link tracking shows you when and how many times your recipient clicks on a link that you've added to an email. Streak tracks your links by default, so all you have to do is drop a link in your email just like normal. You can choose to turn tracking on or off for specific links by clicking on the link and using the toggle feature. To turn email tracking and link tracking on or off for an entire email, click the email tracking icon at the bottom of your draft. When the icon is gray, it means you're not tracking email views or links for this message. When it's orange, it means email tracking and link tracking is enabled. Once you hit send, we'll begin tracking link clicks in this email, and you'll get a notification each time your recipient clicks on one of your links. Link tracking results and data are surfaced in a few different places throughout Streak. The first one is right here in the email message. Hover over the email tracking icon to see link tracking data for each individual message in the thread. You'll be able to see the total number of times your recipient clicked links in this message, as well as when they clicked on links and where they were located if that information is available. Click the same icon in the sidebar to see all of the tracking for the entire email thread. This shows views and clicks for all of your messages and replies in this thread combined. Link tracking is also enabled by default for mail merges in Streak. So if you added links to your mail merges, you can find tracking data for them with your mail merge details. The mail merge lists show you engagement data, including clicks on your links for each mail merge. This is super helpful if you want to set up an A-B test to compare open and click rates so you can pick winning messages and optimize your outreach. Click into any mail merge to see email views and clicks for each individual recipient. In the emails column, an email with a paperclip icon indicates that this recipient clicked on a link in the message. Hover over the email icon to see the time and date that the recipient last clicked a link in your message. Now that you're sending emails and mail merges with tracked links, the best way to utilize link tracking data is through magic columns in a pipeline. Streak has two magic columns for link tracking. They show you link tracking data for the most recent email that's been added to this box. The first column here shows you how many times the recipient clicked on links in the email. And the second one shows you the date they last clicked on a link in the email. You can use the data in these columns to filter for leads who have clicked on your links, divide your pipeline into groups of people who have engaged with your emails, and more. Check out the lesson on column types to learn more about magic columns and the lesson on saved views to learn more about filtering and sorting your pipelines.